little quiet because my little girl is asleep and she has the flu, y'all. So please pray for my little girl. Um, hope, I mean, it seems like she's beating it. You know, she's getting through it. But I hate to see her that way, so I'll show y'all like a little clip of her. She's gonna be doing a wig install. So I'm going to be putting on my same old wig, my same one that I love the most out of all of my wigs that I have. Um, I have, I had a new one that was coming, but I'm gonna give y'all the whole background story with that and how that went. But yeah, so let's get into this video. So my wig cap is not molded, but this is like an old cap that I had for my last wig. It was actually molded, so I just use it because it still has like a little bit of got to be glue on it, and it kind of lays a little bit. But yeah, so that's that. And then this is my same old wig I always wear. It's my baby. So I'm gonna be putting that back on, and I'm gonna show y'all exactly what I'm using. So I don't have on any makeup. I only did like a little bit of highlight and my eyelashes and my um, eyebrows. That's all I did. So I got my 99% alcohol just wipe all that ex excess anything oils anything off get the highest uh, percent of alcohol this is going to get everything I had a little bit of makeup on my damn forehead so this is a four by four wig, so I only put alcohol on this front part. See, hmm, too much, cause I had put foundation on my cap. Okay. I got a wax stick from, well, a wax, a wax stick from She's Bomb. I'm gonna put a little bit on my front of this wig. This wax stick is the bomb, by the way. <laughs> the name fits it. So I need to get all these flyaways out the way. I already got my hot comb plugged in. Okay. Come on me. I'm on the comb and I already put my wax stick on there. And this is an Andes, Andes uh, hot comb. I got this at Walmart. And I'm going to be hot combing the hair back. Ooh. I should have put my tea pans in it to hold it down. But this is good. Let's get this bad boy on. It doesn't have any combs in it, but it has the tightening string in the back, which I sewed them together. Yeah, they're sewed on there. I don't have any combs. I usually just put like one bobby pin to hold my um, pieces that's supposed to go in front of my ears, and that's how I usually do it. So I usually put my wig on just like this. You grabbed it front like that. Okay. Okay, so let me grab my bobby pins. I got three bobby pins, y'all. Three of them. These are not the open pins, these are the closed ones. Hold my side. I'm gonna stick the bobby pin through the through the uh, wig cap and then slide it under my braid. Same for this one. Mm -hmm. 
I know I look rough, y'all. <laughs> but that's how it looks. It's like super plucked because I have like so many parts in this wig, it's not even funny. But I put my money to work. To work. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? To work. Whatever. Let's go. Okay, you guys. So I have the Bold Hold Extreme Cream. So it's no odor, humidity resistant, oil skin. I mean, oily skin and waterproof. So I got this at the Kim's on Nolasville or just any Kim's period or a lot of hair stores have this in Nashville, Tennessee. Um, so yeah, you can find this anywhere. Oh, my cap sliding. Come on, stay right there, baby. Stay right there. That glue gonna keep it down. Okay. Alright. I have a little forehead, so usually what i do you guys is i usually clip this back so that i could see where i'm going to be putting it i got this little oh this little pin this body pin see what that do okay the bobby pin is holding it Okay, so this is a four by four. So let me follow to make sure. It's better to mold your cap down, you guys, but I usually don't keep my wig on that long. This glue lasts up to about two weeks, maybe three. Just blow dry until you see that it's completely clear. A little bit of white won't hurt, but make sure that it's completely clear. What we do here is go back, 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 back. Checking on baby girl. Put at least three layers, you guys, because it's going to last longer once you put three layers. Or you can put a little bit more, up to you. But I always do three. Look, 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 look at this. Somebody come look at this. Look at this. Somebody come and look at this. What are you doing? Fly away. You're supposed to be up there. Look, baby hairs. Be up there. I know you're like, girl, you look so fine, girl. I know. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, my titty.
Are you dry, girl? Are you dry? So I can hook you up. Alright, since it's done, you guys, so let's go. Okay, you guys, so I have my mixing, well, my bottle, my spray bottle. I usually mix it with some water, and I put the She's Bomb foam mousse in there, and it get my hair so bomb. It ain't even funny. So give me just a second, because I'm a little low. One, two, three. I got three pumps of that, y'all, three pumps. I usually go on my side, y'all. Last part. And this is Heavenly Hair, what I have in my head, y'all. I made it into a wig and I dyed it. Um, this is Loose Deep Curls. And the closure is a 4x4 four four, uh, 12A closure that I got at Kim's Hair Plus. And the Heavenly Hair is at Kim's Hair Plus as well on Nolasville. Uh, it's owned by the lady who owns the salon in the back. So go get y'all some. Stop playing. Stop playing. When I get the website, I drop the website for y'all. But yeah, this the hair right here, y'all. It's so bomb. I love this hair. But yeah, I love this hair. So go get you some, babies. Go get you some. It was longer, but I ended up cutting it. And um, yeah, I cut it into like a short bob. One side short, other side like a little longer. But yeah, but I loved it. It was like a bright blue. I had like three different blues on my head. It was so cute. Now it was like more of like a greenish kind of vibe, but a lot of people like it. So I love it, but I keep it moisturized because it's dyed. So I keep like a leave-in conditioner in it. Keep the color somewhat looking good. I like that it's looking more natural now. So yeah, but I'm gonna be using the She's Bomb Edge Control. I love this edge. I use it for my natural hair. I use it for my wigs, baby. I, I use it for my little girl hair. My baby hair is already out to play. It already came out to play. Let me see. It already came out to play. I always usually brush my edges down, and then I put the edge control on it. I'm trying to. One day I'm going to do the mousse. One day. So I heard that was pretty good. The Nairobi. It's called Nairobi. Nairobi Moose. Oh, okay, so I'm going to swoop. Well, I'm going to comb it out a little bit. Swoop it. This is how I like my baby here, as you guys. Nice broad eyebrows, I like them. Let me fix this, because baby, they don't make me mad. My little wax stick on there, y'all. Please, honey. Who you fooling? You ain't about to mess up my shine, honey. Oh, my God. 
we're still plugged in, y'all. Stephanie, a little piece right there. We're gonna call her Stephanie. Stephanie, a little loose. Okay, so she finally loose. She laid down there. Okay, that's what that looks like, honey. Okay, my little cap, y'all. I'm gonna show y'all a way better video. Bless you, Oj. A better video. When I give me a new wig, y'all. But this is my little same old, same old girl. I love her. I pick her out of all my little weeds that I got. I ain't even got no name for this one. It's about Blue Ivy. <laughs> so cute. What about uh, Dolphin? <laughs> Dolphina. <laughs> Fiona. Y'all let me know. Y'all comment down below. What should I name my wig? I know y'all still see my little cap, but that's okay. Because if you can see my cap, you look a little bit too hard. You hear me? So, this is the finishing look, y'all. Let me pull y'all down. Thank y'all for watching this video and thank y'all for almost 50 uh subscribers thank y'all so much like y'all i love the support okay and i see that there's a lot of males that watch as well so i'm gonna be doing some stuff for males as well like advice um i play games and stuff so y'all be able to look out for that but y'all i have my foundation already ready This brush a little big, y'all. Hold on. I got another brush, but I just don't feel like getting it. Get my finger. Foundation in your part to make it more defined if you don't know how to pluck, baby. I pluck my wigs a certain way. Like, this is a little wide, but I like it wide like that. It depends on what kind of wig I'm wearing, how I'm really feeling, you know? If I do like a wide part like that. Mm -hmm. I can't forget that wrapping paper, y'all. So you put your little wrapping paper on. It's like lace paper. Or you can get like neck strips. It don't really matter. Just to hold your lace down and it stretches too pretty good. I got it tied. So yeah, so y'all can just sit and blow dry it or you can just let it just marinate. Walk around, do some stuff, clean up the house, do something washing dishes do something but yeah thank y'all for watching this video and please subscribe and please share and like and comment okay don't be scared because the glimpse we going up first place up in the sky up in the head. i'm tired y'all i ain't gonna lie bye-bye <laughs>